What up, it's JJ JY Fishing. I just wanted to explain to you guys basically why in this episode 9 on like the next two episodes on something before my hair's back to normal. As you know, I shaved it off for breast cancer research, and the reason for it being like this is the original episode 9, the footage got lost. Uh, during the uh, process of uploading it to the computer, we had an issue with the uh, sound being messed up crackly and the video wasn't that good. So rather than give you guys a subpar video, we made a different episode a few days ago at the Bass Ponds called Keeping Scores. We did the best we could, and it's about a uh, seven minute video, excuse me. So enjoy, and that's just the reason for that. And also the reason that is because we have episodes made weeks in advance to ensure the best quality for you guys. So enjoy. I'm out, and enjoy episode nine, Keeping Scores. <laughs> We had little funnel clouds looking like over there, but we're at the we're at the bass ponds. I got chub, gauge. All right, now I'm just using the lipless crankbait, click a shad, clack and wrapper should say. Sorry, going for bass. Perfect day for fishing. Just, we got a weedless jig, eh? Mm -hmm. Working this little opening here for any bass. I still got my top water frog on my spinning rod. Mm -mm. Nothing in here? Yeah. Nothing. Mm -mm. Those guys out there fishing on their boat. <laughs> Take a walk over here to these lily pads and I'll try a couple of pots with this. Perfect day for fishing today, too, eh? Mm -hmm. It's like next to no. Okay, let me make a first cast new record. Mm -hmm. oh, it's already recording, all I gotta do is just hold her and watch me be a monster. What are you using? Top water frog? Yep. Just a little bit to the left. I'll throw a little bit back so you can even watch it come out. Just missed a bite earlier. We um working this on top of lily pads and a little bass came up and hit it, but didn't commit to it. Alright, right now we're tossing out a little crankbait. Uh, we're gonna have a challenge now, so for every fish we catch it'll be a point, but the uh, sunfish, bluegill, they're gonna be a point. Perch are going to be two. Bass, smallies, or largey will be three. And then if we get any trout or any other alternate species, it'll be five. So far, we don't have any points yet, but we'll keep it posted though. Alternate species, five points. Why, well, is he count as panfish or he's count as alternate species? He's kind of a panfish though, isn't it? Ultimate species, I would yeah, say. Yeah, I would say. Look at the size of that rocky though, eh? Say, uh... Monster rock bass. Nice one. Hold him up, Gage. Good one. Alright, the second fish. This is a point for me. Huge bluegill. Look at that. My hands are about 10 inches long, and that rock, or sorry, that blue veil is about a little over. 10 and a half, I'll say about half a pound. New fish of the day, good one. Number two for me, uh, pumpkin seed. Just the same thing I caught the uh, other big bluegill on. Second fish for me, there's one more point. There he goes. Fish number four. Look how you hooked him, oh, there he goes. <laughs> Get a grip on you there. Would you say you beat mine or no? Mm, not uh, sure. Let me compare you to my hand. Remember, I compared mine earlier. Oh, he's, uh, I would say it was a tie, but I would say mine took him. He's a bit heavier, I would say. So close. That's fish number four. Another point for you. So you're at five points now, isn't it? Yep. All right, good job. In he goes. Fish number three for you. Yep. Another one. Another little pumpkin seed. And now you're at five points. So I'm at seven. He's at five. Chubb's at zero still. 
raining again. Got my rig tied out here, waiting for a perch or a sunfish. There goes the bluegill. Sunfish, sorry. Just looking for a big fish, like a bass or anything. We'll keep you posted, though. You almost coming. I got six points. Uh, green sunfish. This fish is brought to you by in part by ResTech. <laughs> <laughs> Chops only on the board, little sunfish. One point for I you. Guy. <laughs> Seven to six to one, so you're on the board, but you're still. Barely full. made it back. Steven's horse almost got him. Second point for Chubb. Another sunfish. <laughs> a little bit smaller than mine. There's another sunfish. Uh, Chubb a calling in between this time, so that's another one for Gage. Now he's beating me eight to uh, seven, and that's the uh, fifth or sixth fish you caught now, isn't it? Six. Yeah. So points wise, um, he's beating me, and now he hasn't beaten me in fish wise. Good fish. I hold him up. Good one. Hand you back in. I caught my largemouth bass, first one of the day. We're about ready to leave. It's been getting pretty damn hot. Uh, what'd you say, about 15 inch? Yeah. 15 inch, pound and a half, two pounder. First time I ever caught one on my bait caster today. I was trying it out today, brand new one. Uh, weedless jig. A little stump in the water. And good result, the first and only largey so far. Cool. Here he comes, here he comes, you going? Yeah. Let's see, what is he? It's a nice bass. He's a largey. Oh, stay hooked, stay hooked. Monster largey. Oh, get, 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 get him, get him, get him. Oh, man. He got him. Woo. A J fish. Holy shit, eh? Now, that was a nice fish. Didn't barely even hook him, eh? Sure rust in that one. Fuck yeah. Yeah. Fish of the day, boys. Fuck, that was awesome, J. Ready? Nice largey. Bam, another 16 inch or maybe more, isn't it? Yeah. 17 inch, where's them people? We're gonna show them, eh? Nice largey. You gotta wipe the lens off, it's got a little water on it. Okay. Hold, you it, get still. That Hold it still. Hold it still. Hold it still. Look better? Yeah, perfect. Nice largey.